Good morning, Skyline. I'm Robin Gonzalez, and your Skyline Scoop starts right now. Let's start our morning with the Skyline Alma Mater. Good morning, everybody. My name is Susan Shin. I'm the, one of the Skyline Senate sponsors. As you know, this past October, our homecoming nominees were charged with collecting money for local charities. And at the dance, we announced those winners who had collected the most money. Well, for some reason, I miscalculated, and I want to make sure that I recognize Miss Angelina Ortiz for raising $853 for her charity, which is Metro Relief. So um, we are going to have two homecoming queens this year. They are two outstanding young women, and I want to make sure that this young lady gets her tiara. So congratulations, Miss Ortiz. I am very proud of you. $853 is a lot of money, and we are so very proud of you. Thank you. Skyline's DECA 1 and 2 did it again. They're headed to DECA State Conference in Houston. Fashion marketing took 10 teams, and five teams advanced to state. We placed two role plays for buying and merchandising, and Natalie Ramirez, Valeria Lomeli, Anaya Walker, and Lanique Mark, all 10th graders. In written projects, Jocelyn Romo and Daniela Hernandez placed an innovation plan. Asia Coleman, Sandy Cabello, and Isabel Perez, Community Given Project Management, and America Garza and Christian Walker for Community Awareness Project. If you're interested in becoming a Skyline Silhouette, there will be a tryout demo class Wednesday in room C15 from 5.30 to 7 p.m. Are you interested in learning more about the design process? Creativity is better with a team, so join us in a safe space to share your ideas. Skyline Design will be meeting tomorrow at 435 in room G11. Attention all students interested in joining the Skyline Raider baseball team. Tryouts will be held today throughout Friday from 445 to 6 p.m. at the baseball field. Scan the QR code to sign up. See Coach Robinson in room 334 or Coach Johnson in F27J for more information. There will be a Senate meeting Wednesday during advisory. Senate members, please report to the auditorium immediately after first period. Are you missing credit from the previous semester? Do you need to recover credits to be reclassified to your correct grade level? The start date is February 6th through May 11th, Monday through Thursday from 5, PM, from 5 to 7.30 p.m. here at Skyline. You must see your counselor to sign up for more information. And now, your weather update, here's Ashton. Thanks, Robin. Today we'll have a high of 55 and a low of 47 with the 89% humidity and a 98% chance of rain. On this day in 2010, a powerful winter storm ran through the Four Corners region of the United States. Freezing rain and powerful winds led to many power outages due to the strain on power lines. Now to a look at tomorrow's weather. There will be a high of 62 and a low of 48 with the 87% humidity and a 81% chance of rain. 
There's 23 days until Valentine's Day, so start planning your surprises and prepare to celebrate. Since candy has such a big role in this holiday, we want to know what your favorites are. Scan the QR code to let us know. This form will be closing at the end of the month, so get your answers in. As of right now, chocolate is still in the lead. Raiders, that's all we have for weather for today. Back to you, Robin. Attention Raiders, Magnet Cluster Changes will be available January 31st. The 11th Raider Battalion has partnered with the North Texas Food Bank to hold a canned food drive. Our goal is to gather 3,000 cans. Glass containers are not allowed, and peanut butter cannot be mixed with other foods. We will be accepting donations until January 31st in room 129. That's all we have for today, Raiders. Until next time, your Skyline Scoop ends right now.